Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at this Red Arc Tow Pro Elite Brake Controller for your Tecantra wiring. Uh, so this is going to activate your trailer's brakes in proportion to your vehicle's braking action. It's going to automatically adjust your trailer's braking based on deceleration of your tow vehicle. It is going to activate immediately, so there's not going to be a pause like you would get with your time-delayed brake controllers. And so it is going to be a really great option for you. This will allow you to very easily connect to a Takancha brake controller wiring harness using the included uh, plug and play adapter here. So very easy to get plugged right in place of your um, Takancha brake controller if you're wanting to switch brands. Uh, so you won't have to worry about splicing into your vehicle's wiring or anything like that. Just plug right into that Takancha wiring and you'll be ready to go. This is designed for trailers with up to three axes. Uh, it's designed for your electric or electric over hydraulic, hydraulic uh, trailer brakes. Uh, so if that describes your setup, this will be a, a really great option for you. Uh, this control knob is going to mount into your dash or other easily accessible area. It allows for fast and easy adjustment of your braking power with the turn of this dial here. Uh, so you, and it also allows you to switch be between your proportional braking, which is more for like your everyday use, and your user controlled mode, which is for like off-roading and other situations where you want more control over your trailer's uh, braking activity. You can also activate the manual override without using your tow vehicle's brakes just by pressing the knob to activate that. And it is going to have bright colored LEDs that indicate uh, the settings and braking power so that you can tell uh, where, you're, where you're working with. The main unit here is going to install out of sight, so it is going to be a lot more convenient uh, than some of your other bigger, bulkier uh, controllers. Uh, this is going to prevent you from having to uh, experiencing banging your knee on a bulky controller. It's also going to reduce the interference with your airbags and other vehicle accessories. And it's going to uh, prevent you from having to try and reach uh, a difficult to reach override lever or uh, an impossible to read screen. And so having this tucked away behind your dash and just having this knob is going to be very convenient uh, to use and control. This does use a three axis accelerometer that is going to measure your deceleration in all directions for precise braking and a nice smooth uniform stopping action. Uh, this can be mounted at any angle and it's still going to accurately sense the deceleration of your vehicle. So very easy to get this all uh, put in place, especially uh, for those of you who already have the Takancha brake controller wiring already installed in your vehicle. Uh, if you don't have that Takancha wiring, uh, the, we do have a kit that uh, does not feature this plug here, so it will uh, wire into your system. So this is specifically for those of you who have that Takancha uh, wiring already, so that it's much easier for you to get that installed. This is going to meet or exceed the UNECE R21 and the FMVSS201 regulations for sustainability and safety. So you can trust it is gonna do a good job for you and keep you safe. Uh, and it is made in Australia. So uh, for those of you who are uh, big fans of uh, land down under, uh, this is coming from um, Australia. So it is gonna do a really good job for you, give you that uh, control right at the, the touch of a dial there so that you can set that power for your braking, uh, switch to that manual braking or your user controlled mode uh, if you're going to be doing some off-roading and that sort of thing. So that completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.